Today we're going to talk about something that I feel like not a lot of coaches and players believe in, believe is possible, or believe that you should be doing. And that's getting better during the season. You should be improving your game, and you can improve your game during your season, throughout your season. And um, so I'm just going to like basically tell y'all some ways that y'all can do this and the best ways that I found out, I found um, from my experience that helped me and the things that I did over my career, especially when I was younger during the basketball season. Now I'm almost 30, so I kind of chilled out a little bit. I still um, try to get better every day. And that's, that should be your goal, man, as a basketball player, especially guys that's 27, 26 and younger, man. Y'all should be trying to get like better in every part of your game every day. Especially, you know, offensively, you can just work on it. Like, it's just nothing but, but work. Um, yeah, so during the season, you should be getting up early, man, going to the gym first thing you do. If you're in high school, you should be getting to the gym before school, college, before your first class, overseas players. Y'all should be getting to the gym in the morning. And whoever watching this, man, the first thing you should do, you should be setting your alarm clock early if, you're not, if you can't really wake up that early on your own, man, and get into the gym. I'm not saying it's go in there and kill yourself, you know what I mean? But you can still go in there and do some ball handling. So 30 minutes of ball handling, man, that is a lot. Your arms are gonna burn, but you're gonna be okay. Your legs are gonna be okay. And do that, man, do some form shooting, just stand in front of the rim. You know what I mean? Just getting reps, seeing the ball going in the net. You know what I mean? You, you in there for 45 minutes, man, you just got a solid workout, man. You just worked on muscle, muscle memory, uh, build, build, Build your muscles, your, your arm muscles, your wrist muscles, and do that, man, every day. And your handles will get a lot better throughout the season. Um, your shot will stay sharp and get maybe get better throughout the season. And that's going to take me to my next point. And, and after practice, I always say after practice is better because you're always you're already warmed up. And some guys like to get in before practice. I used to do that as well, but I want to talk about what I used to do after I'm done telling you. Y'all can, you know what I mean, get better throughout the season. Um, yeah, man. I say after practice, if you can. Most guys can. Can. If you can't, you got to figure it out. But I'm talking to the people that can have time after practice to get some shots up. And I say um, after practice because, like I said, you're already warm. And you can just start right, right, right away and get a lot of shots up or not even a lot. High intensity shots up for about 15 minutes, man. Game shots real quick. Not too long, so you're not really burning yourself out, but you're going game speed, man. Getting a lot of reps up. Get a coach, get a, a teammate that can shoot. You know, you, you don't want to shoot with dudes that can't shoot, especially when you're trying to get in and out. So, yeah, man, get a rebounder and get 15 minutes, man, of hard, like, game speed, even faster than game speed, man. It's like, just go. Um, into that zone, man, and just do whatever, you know what I mean, whatever comes to your head. Don't predetermine. Don't just do catch and shoot. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm talking to my guards, but even though everybody need to work on their handles and they pull up, man, so just don't just do catch and shoot. Just be creative, man, and just have fun. And once that 15 minutes is over, man, get out so you save your, your energy, save your legs, because that's what everybody always worried about. And if you do that every day or five days a week, you shoot every day for sure even on off days. Um, but your your ball handling, waking up early, do that five days a week, man. Every day throughout the season, you will notice how much better your handles will be um, when the season's over and how 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 sharp they will stay and how much better your shot will get and how much more you will, you will score and how much more efficient you will be. And just the game will be a lot easier for you, man. You will stay sharp and you will, you will, you will notice yourself getting a lot better, man. Um, so, yeah, that's basically what I did. I was a little OD with it. I used to work out the same way I work out in the summer, in the season. Um, so I would go to the gym in the morning, man, go before practice, and stay again after practice. I was getting a lot of shots up uh, working on my handles, but I rarely worked on my handles. I shot a lot, a lot of off-the-dribble shots, a lot of threes. And, yeah, so... I, um, yeah, I did that. That's when I was in college. Um, when I got, I'm going to say like the last two years, I chilled out on going in the morning. 
but I still go before practice just to do my handles instead of going in the morning. I don't wake up early to go to the gym, but I still go early to work on my handles 15, 20 minutes every day. Consistency is key, man, and everything. You can't do nothing for three months and then think it's open. No, I do it every day. I go for 15, 20 minutes working my handles hard. And after practice, man, I get I get those shots up, those those game shots, those full speed. Uh, just getting in the rhythm, man, and, and just getting comfortable seeing the ball go in. And, um, yeah, and I just notice myself getting better, man. That's that's why I say, man, your goal should be, and my goal always is get a little better every day. And I can honestly say, Throughout my career, I got a little better every day just by doing those things. And in the summer, obviously, we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about it. We're gonna talk about that a lot more. And I'm obviously gonna show y'all in the summer what I do. Um, yeah, the summer is just that's when you really, really like lock in. That's when you should be focusing on trying to, you know what I mean? Your mindset should always be I'm trying to get to the league. That's always my mindset when I'm when I'm working out in the summer. You know what I mean? I, I promise myself that's gonna be my mindset until I, till the day I retire. You feel me? Until I can't walk no more. Every summer, man, I'm I'm working out like I'm trying to get to the league. You feel me? So, yeah, that's 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 a lot different, grind, man. That's when you your body sore. You it's kind of hard to play in the games like that. So I don't advise that. But yeah, man, wake up in the morning, dog. Build some discipline. You know what I mean? If you if you in high school, if you in high school, it's perfect. Go to the gym before school, man. Six thirty. Seven, whenever, whatever time your school starts, get there early before, or go to the YMCA, or go outside. I don't want to hear no excuses. You feel me? Work on your ball handling. Thirty minutes, do some form shooting. Fifteen minutes, and you out of there. You feel me? And you want to do extra? You know, I'm all for it. And after practice, and man, if you don't, oh, I can't stay after practices. People coming to volleyball team, whatever, bro. Go find a gym, dog. You feel me? I've never in my life wanted to get into a gym. I wanted to get some shots up and didn't find a way. So there's always a way, bro. You feel me? Stop making excuses. <laughs> but yeah, man, that's how you get better during the season. You should be getting better during the season. A lot of people just want to stay, you know what I mean? Stay, stay sharp, get some shots up every now and then. No, bro. All my legs going to be, no, we're not trying to hear none of that. You should be, you should be getting better every single day, especially if you are young dude and you got the energy, man. You should be going hard. And even older dudes, man, Dudes get in their 30s and they start, oh man, I'm a vet. I'm just gonna no bro, keep keep working, dog. This shit over, man. This gonna shit this shit uh over pretty pretty fast, man. So take take the most out of it or make the most out of it and take take advantage of every, every opportunity and just just work, bro, until you can't no more. Um I appreciate everybody that watched the vid. Uh subscribe to the channel, drop a comment, like the vid if this helps you out in any way, share it to somebody that needs to hear this. Uh yeah, man, trying to get into the YouTube algorithm so I can help as many people as possible, as many young hoopers as possible, and people in general. Uh, I appreciate everybody that watched it, man. And I'm out.